Welcome back to Farm Sim 19 with the Rude Man. I know it's been a while. You still in your meeting? Oh, it's a Tuesday. You have meetings every Tuesday? Hey, Tim. Okay. <coughs> yeah. I'll tell you what, first thing I noticed on this map was the artwork. There's a little bit of artwork. This is, this is your home, and you can come up here to sleep. And so it looks like this guy beat us to it. So... I guess inside is a pile of hay that we sleep on, so I thought that was kind of cool. I get a lounge out here by the pool. There's my towel in case I decide to go out into uh, space, because you can't go out into space without a towel. I can't really actually lay on that. Can I sleep on it? Well, I've got a hammock I can sleep in, and then there's a a pool here, it's not very deep because you just kind of walk over the water. Same with the hot tub. Hot tub down here. You just kind of walk across the water. Sound and audio good, thank you. Sound and audio. You mean sound and video, but I got you, I understand. Thank you. Yeah, Scorpion's in a meeting, so it's just me and Tim right now. Um, this is your house. There's a story behind this. I didn't spend a lot of time on it. As a matter of fact, I spent maybe 10 minutes on the farm. Um, I don't have anything except for that truck and a couple of tractors. And that's all you get when you start this map. You get two tractors and a fertilizer spreader and that painting on the door that I showed you. That's all you get. Well, and the pickup, which is a piece of crap. So, and this house, and I guess you inherited this house. And you can decide how to play the game from this point. Basically, the decision is whether you want to keep the house or not. So, 
if you want, you sell the property here and then you start a farm. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to try to do something different. Hey, Craig. Craig's lurking. Well, you were lurking. Now you're talking. But you can lurk. If I had my way, I'd be lurking as well. All right, Tim. I'll take a look at it. So, one of the reasons I, I like No Man's Land is because it's an alien gym now. This channel is friends with Alien Jim, so we like his stuff. All right, here's town. I haven't played this map, so I don't know anything about it other than that little bit that I told you earlier as to how to start it, whether you want to sell a house or not. I'm going to see how far I can go. I've got my initial $1,000, and I've got the two tractors and a fertilizer spreader, and that's it. That's all I got. So I'm going to go to the shop. That's where my equipment's at. So we're just kind of driving through town here. There would be traffic, traffic except I turned it off. I'm looking for a freeway because that's how you get around. Look, there's a Burger King. There's a post office. Whoa. I guess this is the freeway, so... Let's head down the freeway to the shop. But I think the shop is across the river. Because there's a river that runs through it. Uh, where's the shop? I'm lost now. Let me get off the freeway. Okay, there's the shop. All right, let's get back on the freeway. Well, we need to cross the tracks. Yeah, I know. I wasn't supposed to do that. I did it anyway. Oh, crap. I'm on the wrong road. Good thing there's no traffic, eh? I guess I could, I could try the traffic. I haven't tried the traffic because I normally don't like it. I'll see what the traffic's all about. Maybe it's not too bad. I have no idea. I don't know anything about it, Tim. I, I haven't read anything about the map. I don't know anything about it except for Scorpion said he was playing. That's the only thing I know, and that's almost a month old, that information. Because I've had kind of a tough time with it. These three pieces of equipment are mine. All I did was take the equipment that the, that the farm came with and swapped it out. I got my John Deere, my JB, JCB, and I got a little bit bigger um, fertilizer spreader. Traffic is fast? Great. So, yeah, I don't know anything about the map. I'm going to park the truck here. And this is how I'm going to try to play it. For now, anyway, I might change my mind and just cheat the hell out of it, but we'll see. Uh, it's a pretty nice looking map. I don't know anything about it, as I've said ten times now. Uh, what am I doing? All right, let's go in here and uh, do what? Uh, turn this on. I forgot how to play. It's been a long time. I'm going to turn this on for now. And... Um, I do have, although I don't know how to turn it on, uh, control B, I've got um, auto drive and I don't know how to turn it on, it's control something, no wait, maybe it's alt something, 
to turn it on. I don't remember. I've never used it before, so I don't know how to use it. Oh well, I'm not going to use it now anyway. Uh, okay, control zero. Really? Nope, that didn't work. Do you have to be in a tractor? Maybe you have to be in a tractor. Or a truck or something. Nope, control zero don't do nothing. Whoa, what the hell was that? Controls O turns everything off. That's cool. I didn't know that. Alt, rather. Yeah, I tried that before I tried control. It's just honking my horn. Hey, boys, how you doing? Alt keypad zero. Okay, alt keypad zero. All right, there we go. Um, I tried to look up a little bit about the auto drive because I'd never used it before. And the only uh, videos that I could find were of a version older than what I've got. So the controls were different. So I, I just said hell with it and stopped messing with it. But I remember that you used the... Uh, the mouse wheel, press the mouse wheel, and that gives you your cursor. I do remember that. And that's how to turn it on. And that's how to record. And that's about the hell all I know. So, uh, anyway. That's it. That's all I know. That's all I really cared to find out, really. Um, let me get out of here. If I can't... Oh, shit, I'm stuck. How do I get out of here? I'm going to have to drive out. I stuck myself between equipment. Okay, so here's what I got. I got $100,000. A couple of pieces of equipment. That's about it. And there's some land here. Now, this land right here, I think, belongs to Big Daddy Property Management. Is that... I, I like I said I read a little bit about the instructions and stuff the description hi southern lady but it didn't make any sense to me is big daddy his dad or is that just the name of the property management so because he, they made it sound like you're worthless and your dad doesn't your dad hates your guts or something or your dad's your partner or your dad because they said something about that being your boss well, is your dad the boss of you? Um, I mean, mine was at least till I was 11, 12 years old and I left home. But um, anyway, boy says he loves Farm Sim 19. I used to could. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to I'm going to use a global company. And uh, these first few fields here. I don't have a farm. I have a luxury house that I live in. So um, I'm going to... Oh, God dang it. I was going to cheat and put in uh, my cell point. Oh, I didn't do it. I wanted to do that not online. Because uh, I don't know where to sell anything. Whoa! That guy's quick. There must be an extra go fast lane. Um, I don't know. You know these, you know these old people walking around. What the hell? Must be a nursing home around here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lease. Is what I'm going to do. And then I need to figure out where to sell my stuff, and I want the best price. That's why I was going to put a uh, my own sell point in. Okay, boys. Thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate it. I really do. Um, have a good night's sleep. Everybody needs that. Mm. 
if you use easy mode. I, I've never used easy mode, but I haven't generally. So, okay, so I'm, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do... Uh, I'm going to do uh, global company and I'm going to lease the field. I think this is field 68. I'm going to lease it. I'm going to get the crop off of it and I'm going to sell it. Okay, I forgot what field this is. Uh, what field is this? 68. Yeah, 68. Okay. It's free. Look at that. It's not really, but okay. To lease, that's going to cost three thousand and uh, three thousand three hundred sixty-nine dollar. I say field sixty-eight for thirty-three sixty-eight lease, lease tag. Oh, wait a minute. I don't understand this. What does this mean? I've never used this program before. Field 68 for three thirty-three thousand. Is that the lease? Then if it is, then what's this over here? Anybody use this program? In the big town, best price. Okay. All right. Well, I don't understand this lease thing, but I don't have any other money. I can't buy the field. I've only got $100,000, and I have no equipment. Price is upkeep a day. I don't plan on keeping it for a day. I just want to lease it and get the crop off of it. Too late now. All right, that took that took my uh, about a third of my money, and now I have to lease a combine, not a forage combine. Combine, com, not a multi fruit combine. Where the hell's a damn combine? There they are. All right, I don't know what to tell lease. Uh, lease the cheapest one I can find. The case is probably not gonna be it. The John Deere's are pretty cheap. That A lease on that would be good. Jesus, not that one. Wait a minute, this Dominator's pretty cheap. That one's expensive. This one, this one's cheap. Right here, I could lease that one. Okay, I don't care what color it is. Um, just leasing it, right? So, design, engine setup. Uh, how much is that gonna change the price? A thousand. All right, let's lease that. Suppose I'm going to need a header, right? Corn header. I want a good size one. Uh, I don't care what color it is. I'm leasing it. Doesn't matter. Uh, let's do that. Okay, and then I need something to pick the stuff up with. I got a tractor, so I'm going to buy a trailer. Well, not buy. I'm not going to buy a trailer, but let's find a cheap trailer I can lease. A grim, grim, grim pack. That one. Grim pack. We got any real mods? Crap, I don't. Well, that one. I could use that one. That's a tractor pull. Um, let's lease that. Uh, 
Okay, that leaves me with just $60,000. Hey, Dennis. How you doing? Jason Spears in the house. Dennis, how are you? I thought uh, Boyce went to bed. He says, hi, I'm Dearmo. Hey there, all the way. All the way, I got it. It was a nice start with a new TikTok. It was the start time for us, and I got it. Okay, I don't know what that means. Tim's going to tell me how to farm after all these years. Thank you, Tim. I think the... All right, let's get this going here. Yeah, so... Uh, I almost couldn't live stream today. I got a lot of stuff going on. I, I had, um, yesterday I was gone all day to the doctors in Portland, the big city, so it was an all day thing. One of them was my heart doctor. And uh, he's wanting me to go and have another stress test, a stress test, which doesn't sound good to me. Uh, I'm finally, finally over the second COVID shot that I got this last week. I did get chills and a fever. That's why you didn't see me last week. Um, I wasn't feeling good. Today is my daughter's birthday, and they're all out there. Until I, and I, I said I wasn't going to live stream because you know the couple of families here. They told me no. Go ahead and live stream. We'll just chat and do stuff. And, uh, you know, they'll do something later there. Actually, my daughter wanted lasagna for her birthday, so my wife said, well, okay, then get in the kitchen and help me make it, and we can bond <laughs> after all these years. Just kidding. Um, I can teach you how to make it type of a thing. Jesus Christ, that guy's going fast. Pardon my French. Whoa! How do you get in this field? Probably not from this freeway. So then... So I did come in and live stream. It's been about a month since I did anything. But then again, like I said, I wasn't really feeling that percent. I have to feel I have to be honest with you guys. I am for the first time in my life starting to feel my age. And it's kind of scary. Okay, don't these open? Yeah, they do. All right, how's the damn thing open? There it goes. Why does it? Oh, I guess it couldn't open on the on the road, could it? That probably wouldn't be a good thing for the highway. Is Andy here? Andy. How am I doing? I'm okay. Kinda. All right, so let's get the tractor. Where'd my trailer go? There it is, trailer for rent. Trailer for sale or rent. Voice is saying something, but I didn't understand. Like your videos. Thank you, Dennis. Jason. Did I miss Jason? No, I said hi to Jason. How you doing, Jason? I want to get all this stuff in the field because until I get that edge combine, that gate's going to be in my way. Right, I'm assuming that. That's right. Voice, voice says that uh, Irish say it is high.
And he said his mouse is... What? My mouse is doing my head in? Oh, great. I, there go... I'm gonna have to turn that... Oh. Why did I turn that off? Yeah, you, do you have that meeting every Tuesday now? That'd get old. Right, the straws are already enabled, so I don't have to do anything. It's automatic. I kind of thought it was when you first when you first buy a machine. It's the default is to have the straw thing down. Wait a minute. I thought the straw thing was on. It said it was. And now it's off again. I swear it said it was on. It says straw's not available on this. On this field. So I don't know what I don't know what Lee was talking about. I thought he knew. Not not all maps have that straw windrow. Matter of fact, I've only played one or two that did. Alright, how do you shut the gate now? Do I have to be out here? Alright, here we go. Andy's Distillery. Don't they know that when you're in a meeting, you're not making them any money? Well, to tell you the truth, I don't really like it, so... If it's on a map, you're forced to use it. But... So I don't know what the weather's like where you guys are at, but this week is supposed to be gorgeous. It started out over the weekend. It was a little bit rainy. Uh, Sunday night, we got a little bit of rain. Yesterday, I got up and went to, the, to Portland, and it was bright and sunny. It looked like a summer day, only it was only 60 degrees. But then our summer days are only 60 degrees. All right, I'm stuck. I've got it full throttle in reverse and nothing's happening. Hey Dustin, long time, no chat. How's Dustin doing? You have a chance for rain every day? Well, I guess we do too on the coast, but it's supposed to be mostly sunny. I don't know why I'm going so slow. I got full throttle going here. I wonder if the header's dragging. Pick it up. All right, I can go forward. I can go backward. 
when I drop it is when I'm having trouble. I bet that I bet that header's dragging on this combine. But I, I can't afford to unlease it and lease another one. Remember this and see if there's a different header that works better. Busy, work, busy working two jobs. Well, you're okay, Dustin. I haven't been around for a month. Yeah, I'm almost to a complete stop. Dog on it. It's got to be this header. Um, let me see. Thunderstorm, eh? Lightning. Thunder and lightning, everything frightening. It really goes downhill, though. Is it maybe the hill? Maybe it's not the head. Maybe this combine is just weak. I suppose. So what have you guys been up to since the month I've been gone? I did one live stream last week, wasn't I? I think I did. Did I? So I haven't been around for about a month. It's been weird. Really. Life in these times is completely messed up, I'll tell you. All the junk is going on. Man, they really got this field up against that fence. Don't they? I guess it's not too bad. Get it to the right angle. So Dustin, what's new in your life? No sunshine when I'm gone. <clears throat> I don't know. It's, is it allergy time? Because I keep having goo, gluey, mucky eyes. I don't know what to say. Gooey eyes. I get up in the morning, my eyes are all welded shut. <clears throat> I keep trying to clear my throat. Junk. Doo -doo -doo. I think it's allergy stuff. I used to not have allergies. I don't know what that's all about. Do you develop allergies as you get older? Let's find out if I can go uphill. <laughs> not really. It must be the combine. Now you know why it was cheap.
Eye boogers, yeah. A little bit more than eye boogers. It's like somebody put uh, pancake batter in your eyes. I think I'd rather have the pancakes. Know what I mean? I'm getting close to a full load here. I gotta make uh, sixty thousand, or I'll be in the hole. Because I started out with a hundred thousand. If I don't make sixty thousand on this field, it's not gonna be worth it. I'm gonna be losing money. I hit that, I can't go off spot. They couldn't keep you in the hospital because of that? What? What did I miss? I was attacked by the stock bull last week. My two legs are broken. I have two slip discs in my back and a broken left arm. Jeez. That's not good. Ninety-five percent. I'm gonna call the truck in. They can't keep you in the hospital because of COVID. Well, you know what? Uh, I don't like being in hospitals anyway. People die in hospitals. You know? Healthy people. In a wheelchair for nine months. I'll tell you what, if they ever put me in a wheelchair, it better have a big motor on it. Scorpion, always the always the compassionate guy. Bull zero. Or I mean uh Boyd's zero bull one. Oh crud, this isn't It's electronic. Well, I hope it's got a good motor on it. I want mine to do about 25 miles an hour at least. And I want uh, I want a great big uh, bull bar on it so I can push people around. Okay, what's going on? Nothing is going on. I got to conserve gas, so I turn that off. It's going to take a long time if I have to keep driving up and down the field. I don't know what to do about it. I don't have any money to lease a different combine. But I guess I'm going to have to. If I make any money, I'm going to have to lease a different combine. This isn't going to work. Looks like it's going down, you know, but it's hard to tell. It? Yeah, I'm stuck. 
Yeah, I can't go forward now. I've got full throttle and I'm not moving. In all my rodeo days, I didn't get hurt that bad. I, I've never broke a bone that I know of. That's and the reason I say that I know of, I've got a little finger that I hurt one time, and it it does kind of it does well not really. I didn't, couldn't tell whether it was broken or not, so I didn't go in and have anything done. I didn't have it looked at or anything. I could have broke it. I stubbed my toe one time and wasn't sure whether I broke it or not. So I never went into the doctor, I just let it go. But neither one of them, now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't look crooked in any way, my finger. I don't look at my toes because I can't see them anymore. But uh, yeah, so as far as I know, I've never broke a bone. But that would be awful. Ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Your wife's pregnant and she can't help you? That would be not good. Well, I mean, what are you going to do? You know, you, you, can't, you can't take a second wife that could help you. Has your wife got a sister? There you go. They can share responsibilities or something. I'm going to make a mess out of this field. I just know. At least you got your brother and his wife to help. God, I remember when Carol was uh, pregnant with our first child. And she was like eight or nine months pregnant. And I was roofing the garage. And my dad and my brother were there helping me get this garage roofed. And uh, we, we were up on the roof. And every time we'd, uh, one of us would, would get ready because we were running out of shingles, at the top, right at the top of the ladder, my wife's head would pop up with uh, a stack of uh, roofing material on her shoulder. Nine months pregnant, she's hauling roofing tiles up to the, on the top of the garage. We kept yelling at her. And she said, well, I can't help it. I'm just full of energy. And I said, yeah, the doctor told you that energy you, you should reserve up. Your body does that when you're getting ready to have a child. It gives you all kinds of energy. You're not supposed to use it. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. Got new equipment. And that'd be tough. The, the, the things you gotta go through in life to survive. Well I can't I can't I haven't used that mod. Uh, I'm not surprised there is one, but 
I'm not gonna stop the stream just to do it. We'll just make we'll make do. We'll make do. I'll just sit and chat while I'm doing this. And <clears throat> we'll get we'll get through it. What's that, Andy? You're selling the bull? I'd eat that some gun. Some gun. Almost said a bad word. I'd uh, chop his little things off, start grain feeding him. And I'd laugh every time I went out there to feed him that grain. Soften him up a little bit. All right. Hey, take care of yourself, buddy. But uh, thanks for stopping by. Take care of yourself. Take care of your family. They'll get you through it. We'll be thinking about you. This feels goes uphill or downhill. I think we're going uphill now. Man, they can be dangerous. People don't get it. They really don't. That's like people go, driving through the forest and thinking it's nice to to op open the window and pet a bear or something. You know? It's like, are you crazy? Those are wild animals. You look like food to them. People do it though. You can watch videos about that. Well, there's videos out there, I've seen them, where people are driving through one of these pet reserves, you know, that you can drive through and there's lions roaming around and tigers and stuff. And you're told, do not roll your windows down. Do not feed the animals. Do not get out of your car. And people still do it. They think that these are pets or something. I watched one video where this woman jumped out of her car in a, one of those places and because she had to go to the bathroom and she didn't see anything so she got out to go to the bathroom and while she was out in the weeds a, a tiger came along and she was trying to run to get in the car and she couldn't get in the car and the tiger grabbed her and drug her away from the Car. and the, the husband got out and tried to help her and so did the mother the, the grandma they didn't see the second tiger second tiger I think got grandma and they lost two people in that silliness I think I'd have just stayed in the car and pissed my pants I mean it's sad but I mean Really, it's kind of dumb, too. Can you imagine getting to the pearly gates and they say, okay, so how'd you die? They got their clipboard out. Were you good? Were you bad? How'd you die? Well, I died pissing my pants while I was getting eaten by a tiger. And well, that's pretty stupid. Mama, anything's are nasty. 
in the animal world, there's nothing meaner than a mama. Seriously. Even humans, you don't want to get between a mom and their kids. If they're a decent mom in the first place. All right, I gotta get this fence open because I'm gonna need it open here sooner or later. While I'm here. Just getting ready. Yeah, it, it is kind of silly. Irish women are tough too. So are Scottish women. Actually, all all of them are. They're just if they're mama, don't rile them up. Well, it's like I say, you know, they don't, if you're, if you're a city person and all you see are people on TV that have animals for pets and you, you think a bear's, you know, just some big fuzzy uh, teddy bear, they don't realize they're, they're wild animals. They're looking for food most of their life. You look like a big Oscar Mayer wiener to them. Without the bun, they don't need the they don't need the buns because uh, you know they're they're car they're on those bears they're on carb free diets you know they don't, they don't want their buns. Evidently, evidently this header might be too big for this. Combine. I didn't think about that. I got the biggest header, and it probably isn't made for one because the pipe doesn't even go out far enough. Yeah, grandmas are tough too. Grandmas are actually tougher than moms because grandmas grew up with, you know, on the farm and stuff. I think grandmas could even eat snakes. That's a reference to Craig. Oh yeah, I remember going to my grandma's house out on the farm and she'd be out there chopping chickens heads off for dinner and, and uh, whatever it took. <laughs> Not gonna eat your, not your snakes, rabbit stew. What's today? Tuesday? It is Tuesday. What a beautiful day. I got my camera out the window. It's just, there's not a cloud in the sky. It's just a beautiful day. It's supposed to be that all way, all, that way all week. Now, the thermometer says it's 73 out, but I don't think it is. Um, 
I think it's bare, it's in at 60, but it's not 73. But the thing is, the thermometer, uh, not a, it's not a thermometer. It's a uh, it's a sensor that registers for the clock that I'm looking at. But it's right out in the sunshine, so it's not going to tell me the true temperature. I guess I could ask what's your name. Alexa, what's the temperature? Yeah, she says it's only 52. I didn't think it was all that warm because it was kind of chilly out. There's a little bit of a breeze of blowing. But yeah, that sensor's sitting right out in the sun against the wall, so it's getting the radiant heat from the building as well. Uh, I don't really care about the temperature in the summertime. I just want to know in the wintertime when things are going to freeze. It's pretty accurate in the winter time, but I've got one out in the front yard, one in the backyard. One in the backyard's in a gazebo, so it's in shade. Oh, your great grandma. So what's going on with you guys? I haven't seen you in a month. Are you still playing the same game? Anybody doing anything different? We just got a new patch today on uh, Final Fantasy XIV, it's a game that I play. A big patch. I'm anxious to get in and find out what's going on there. Uh, we were getting ready to run a dungeon, I know. Well, actually, we've got two two dungeons left, and then we've completed the first part of the game. Uh, Jeff and Gavin were waiting to do that, and I told them they'd have to wait until after my, after my live stream. They, were, they wanted to be very anxious to run those two dungeons, get their level 50 stuff. I am too, but... Uh, we were going to do it last night, but we ran out of time because they were getting ready to shut the game down for that maintenance to put the new patch in. And we didn't have enough time to run the dungeons. So we said to heck with it and went to bed early. I grabbed a book, started reading the book before I went to bed. You got sacked from my job? At traffic control, too, too many crashes. What? What? Was it? What? what? Was it your fault? Jonathan's in the house. I'm not sure if I understand. Traffic control. What is that? Are you? Are, what are they? Are, are you a traffic light? They got you hanging from a pole and. Is it something different over in England? <coughs> All right, finally, I think we got this one wiped. Didn't even get a half a trailer. That must be a pretty good sized trailer. It is a mod. It's one I modded, so. It's probably a good size. <laughs> All right, but keep your fingers crossed that I made enough money to make this worth my time. Scorpion, where do I go to sell this? You said it was in town.
guess I can check. Never mind. I'll just look on this thing here. All right. What do we have? What is this? This is corn, right? Corn. Oh, look at look at all the pretty icons up here. All right. Best price, and it's going down. Jeez, I better sell quick. At Central Grain, I better sell it quick. Right there it is. If I get hit by one car, the traffic's going off. I think that might work. Uh oh. Oh no. I think I'm on the freeway and can't get off. Could I went the back way? I screw up. Ah. Where am I? I can't tell where I'm at. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I need to be over here, right? That's a good guess. Is that where I'm supposed to go? No, right back there. Okay. Okay, keep your fingers crossed that I at least make my 100,000 back. That'd be a bummer. be a short game if I can't make enough money to farm. Alright, I made a little bit. I'm going to make a little bit. 20,000, 30,000, 40,000, 50,000. Because you got to remember, I got to buy seed fertilizer and all that kind of junk to redo the farm. All right, 196. So I made 96,000. Well, I made 137, it says, but that don't matter. I started out with 100,000, so. Now, I need enough money to seed and fertilize, and I still got the equipment that I need to... Uh, I don't have a plow. So I'm going to have to have a plow. Maybe I should have leased a different deal. One that's a little bit better shape. Where do these roads go? How's Trenton doing? We need to tell Cowboy Trenton about Ford Voice. Uh, Trenton, uh, I don't know if you remember, I can't pronounce his first name, Voice. Isn't he from Ireland? Is he from Ireland, guys? Did I, did I get that right? Uh, he got attacked by the, by the farm's bull. Broke both legs and all kinds of other stuff. He's in a wheelchair. He couldn't stay in the hospital because of, there's COVID and they wouldn't let him stay in the hospital. Oh, Jesus, how'd the time get up? Oh, how'd the time get up like that? Dang it. I lost my daylight because of it. Dang it. 
I didn't get hit by the car, but I got wrecked because of it. Oh, I screwed up again. I took the wrong turn. At Albuquerque. What else did he break? I can't remember. I know he broke the, both the legs. Yeah, and he said it's really bad because, you know, he's still got farm work he needs to do. And his wife is pregnant and can't do the work. But uh, he said he had a, br uh, a, a brother and, and, a, bro and a wife, uh, a, a sister-in-law. So his brother and, and his brother's wife are helping him on the farm, thank God. So I don't know what else he'd do, poor guy. Terrible stuff, man. Hey, if I could, I'd go over and help him. I wouldn't be much help, though. I could supervise, though. I supervise very well. Where's the plows at? Anybody see him? Plows, there we go. I hope I got that big. Oh, I do, I do. Okay, I'm going to get this one. I'm not going to buy it. I'm leasing everything because I don't have any money. Get out of the way, JCB. You're in the road. Uh-oh, I lost it. Yeah, at least they put him in a wheelchair with a motor on it. That's a good thing. Good guy. What? I plowed a least field? Wouldn't you plow it? Aren't you supposed to get better crops if you plow it? I thought you're supposed to plow the fields. Okay, I'm confused. Why would I not plow it? Bill's in the house. There's no collision on this plow. Thank God. I didn't shut the gate. Bill's yelling at Andy again. <clears throat> okay, Scorpion, that's... Yeah, I just didn't understand why I wouldn't plow it. Oh, Andy thinks I'm leasing it and then turning the lease in. Oh, no, I'm leasing it because I don't have any money to buy land. So I'm leasing the land until I make enough money to buy it. So I got to treat it like my own. I've never done this before, like this. But it was either that or sell my fancy house, and I didn't want to do that. It's like a master pad. It's got hot tubs and and fancy toilets and all kind of stuff in it. Although you can't get in it, so I don't know what's going at it. Yeah, I'm a broke back bitch.
he can milk cows with his one good arm. <laughs> Man, you're sick, Scorpion. You got no compassion. Poor guy. Can you imagine the pain he's in? Good lord. And that's not even the half of it. Getting hit like that had to wrench his back and stuff. So even if he's not, you know, broke, he's got to be in pain. get a lot of money for that house to buy a cheap farm. Really? You think I should sell the house? Well, it looks like I'm going too fast in the plow skipping. just piss and moan all the time. Andy says he's getting the blame for everything. Scorpion says he gets the blame for everything. I don't know what Bill's problem is, but <laughs> guys, oh, woe is me, I guess. Look, you don't even need to have the plow up down. Look at that. I didn't know that. Scorpion, did you know that? That was weird. Bill's just Bill. What would we do if Bill wasn't Bill, though? There'd be some stranger here giving us a hard time. Who, who wants to be given a hard time by a stranger? It's a pretty good plow if you can keep it from bouncing. Got ducks in the house. Bill said, oi. Jonathan said he doesn't complain. Well, I'm not a complainer. I'm a downright bitcher. I bitch about everything. I'm not an evil bitcher, though. I bitch for fun. Actually, who was it? Artie Glenn? Remember Artie Glenn? Lynn used to say I was a whiner. I am kind of a whiner. It's for fun. that uh, you have to sell that oh that uh, that that painting that's the sleep sign huh? or that's the sleep point huh well I wasn't going to do it but if you think it's a thing to do maybe I could where's the farm you can buy I haven't even looked at this map I have no idea what it looks like Where, where's the farm you buy and does the farm come with any land? I don't think it does, but... Well, I don't know. Yes, the slate and the painting is the sleep. Okay. 
Well, how do you get a new sleep point? You have to buy the painting again? Can't you just move it? Just look one on the big map. I have to do that myself. Boots are the cheapest. Okay, now you've got me completely confused. I have to buy boots? I can't farm in sandals or house slippers. I like to farm in those slippers that have the little bunny ears on them. That's the best way to farm. I haven't looked at this map. I don't even know what kind of uh, what it's all about. Even. I don't really care. I was just getting bored playing that other map. Try something new. Best farming done in Crocs. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I thought it was something that came with the field or the map. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, let's see what I got. Uh, miscellaneous farmhouse. I got a painting for 50 bucks. The painting's only 50 bucks. That's pretty damn cheap. That's pretty cheap. But where's the real estate agent? What was that you're talking about? Okay, Scorpion says the painting sleep mod is expensive. But just a minute ago, he said the boots were only 50 bucks. I just went in the sleeping paint painting was only 50 bucks. Oh, he thought it was 20K. Yeah, there's a big difference there. Carol bought me, I told her that um, she wanted to know if I wanted some more uh, Twinkies. And I said, no, nah, I'm getting sick of the Twinkies. Uh, I'll tell you what, I haven't had them Zingers for a long time. And she said, okay. So she got me some Zingers, but they're raspberry. I'm, uh, raspberry? I thought they were strawberry. I don't know if I want raspberry Zingers. I haven't had one yet. I had to go to the doctor yesterday, I told you guys. I stopped, bought me a dozen Krispy Kremes. I still got one of those now. Out of the dozen. I eat the hell out of those. Nutter Butters? I've never had a Nutter Butter. I'm doing to this combine. That's what boys need to do to that bull. Just knock him around a few times. 
punch him in the bullions. Slap his bullions around. That would teach that boy. Moon pies? What the hell is a moon pie? Your zingers were chocolate? Oh, God. I wouldn't eat them if they were chocolate. I don't like chocolate. Uh, I don't like chocolate cake. And I don't like dark chocolate. I like milk chocolate, and that's about it. Now you got me curious, though. So I'm going to grab one of these raspberry zingers and see if they're any good. How the hell you open this? They don't want you to get in these. There's no easy way to open them. Okay, there's supposed to be one of them zipper things on the end, but it don't work. Well, it kind of did, but not really. Carol gets mad at me when I eat these things because they, they're, she buys them in a box. And it, now if you buy them just in the packet, they come with two, like Twinkies. There's two side by side in a packet. When you buy them in a box, there's just a box of them. And Carol says, why are you eating two? You should be eating only one. I said, no, if you buy them in the store, you, you get two, so I'm eating two. Good Lord. They shrunk these things down since the last time I bought one. This is only about half the size of a normal one. All right, well, the raspberry tastes okay. I guess. The creamy stuff in the middle still tastes the same. Waffle World. Daddy? Well, there's another kid I found out I never had. Every time I turn around, I'm finding new kids I didn't know I had. Uh-oh. What's this now? Yuck with the raspberry. Well, raspberry, I don't dislike raspberry, but it's not my favorite. Carol eats a lot of raspberry stuff. She likes anything that's sweet. All right, I don't know where the real estate agent is. I gotta find a real estate agent. I don't know where in the hell is that. Okay, so Scorpion said I have to go in here and sell something. I don't know what it is. This thing, I guess. Don't I have to go in the garage? I have to go in the garage and sell this thing. Should I sleep first? Maybe I should sleep first. Help, I'm stuck. Anybody know where my house is? It's up on the hill here. I'd hate to have a bachelor pad like this because I'd get drunk, fall off the edge and into the river. So I think this is mine right here. Sleepy time. I can't get up the stairs. 
Oh, there we go. Come on. There we go. All right, it's nine o'clock in the morning. I guess I could sleep the. I can sell the. I wasn't gonna do this, but in actuality, I really never used a farmhouse, and this isn't a farmhouse anyway. This is like a luxury, you know, bachelor pad or something. So I guess I don't need it. I can trade it for a farm. Okay. Okay. Uh, but now I need to buy a farm, so I don't know what to do. Uh, I don't know. Somebody said there's a real estate agent, but I don't see one. Don't they, don't they come to your house? Don't they have to do work when you hire them? You know, if I have to go search for them, what the hell that? That's no... That's no good for me. The wife's making snow cones. God, he's got his wife suffering in, in the kitchen all the damn time. Okay. Hey, Binks is in the house. Hey, Binks, how you doing? Look at the big map. Okay. I don't see nothing. Can't see a thing. There's a bail cell point. I don't see nothing. Oh, that map. You mean the world map? You didn't say the world map. He said the big map. Well, I guess the world map is bigger than that one. I'm looking. I don't see nothing. Wouldn't the real estate guy be in the town? Sp Spockily potato. Spockily potato. That doesn't make any sense. Flour mill, central grain. Export, there's a Walmart. The big farm is near 122. I heard that too, God Duck. I thought I was the only one. I thought it was coming from outside. Was that in the game? Okay, there doesn't seem to be a real estate agent. I don't know why he would be outside of the town. Um, because I don't know how to sell the house. I mean, my house should be right here, but it doesn't look like I can sell it. Land. Oh, there it is. Never mind. I found it. I thought my house was up here. It's not. What's it sell for? Wow. Uh, it sells for six hundred fifty-nine thousand. Wait a minute. Did I already sell a sell point? I can't remember. Garage. I did. Okay. 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 What was I doing? Oh, I was selling property. Land. 600000 for that? Jeez. That sure still doesn't give you a lot of money. Now, Scorpion said something about... Oh, oh, if Scorpion makes something up and it's not there, it's just, just a joke. 
Okay. <laughs> uh, Binks, do I know where copyrighted music is? Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean. You you want to to buy copyrighted, or do you mean? I'm not sure what you mean. With YouTube, there's a place where you can get uh, music that isn't copyrighted that you can use in your YouTube. You know, it's not not real good music. Well, some of it's not bad, and there's not a lot of it. Oh, you get extra money just because. Okay. And you said there's a farm by 122 uh, right here. Is this the big farm right here you're talking about? Right there. And that's uh, that's more money than I have. I, I don't have enough money. So now I've sold my house for nothing. Okay. Well, I got to go back to plan A. On this map, there are two places that play music. Oh, how do you turn it off? You've got to go into the... Uh, you've got to go into the game. Uh, and you should be able to find the music and, and delete it. The sound files and stuff. There used to be a game that I played that had a uh, air balloon in it. And whenever the air balloon came around where you were, it was so loud, it was irritating. And I just went in and turned it off. And then in Manchester, do you guys remember Manchester? Was that 2015 that I was playing Manchester? And then you went to the barn, the horse barn, and they were playing some country singer singing about my, you know, my girlfriend likes my John Deere or whatever. And, uh, yeah, I had to delete that, too. So, yeah, there's a file. You need to go into the sound files and just delete them. Yeah, the bells. The church bells got me uh, copyrighted. I don't think you have to go to Giant Editor, but I'm not sure. You might have to. But someplace in there, you'll find those sound files. You just have to delete them. I haven't run into that yet, so... Evidently, the uh, the mod author's not a YouTuber, or he wouldn't put stuff like that in. I'd look right now, but I'd have to stop the stream, so... All right, so I got to get back to work here. But yeah, you can find them. You might have to go into Giant Editor. I didn't think you did, but you might have to. Uh, but there should be... In, in 2019, a lot of the modders make it a lot easier because they, they make all that... They put all that stuff in files and not, with, not within the game. <coughs> Yeah, but there, you shouldn't have to actually physically go to where the sounds are. Someplace in the file folder, there should be sound files, and you should be able to just delete them. On this one, I'm not sure. I did not know there was a problem with this. So I'm going to have to do that too if I get around that area because I, uh, I can't have that in my videos. All right, so I've got this done. Let's go get, uh, I need to get my tractor. Whoa, all right, I said the first time I got hit by a car, that was going away. That's it. That's it. They're gone.
You've been playing for a week, never got you here. been playing this for a week. You were playing this before I left and that was almost a month ago. Now I gotta find out where to buy the fertilizer. And I don't know how much to buy. Alright, where do I buy the fertilizer? Oh, that whole damn thing comes up. I forgot that. Anybody know where the fertilizer might be? There should be a store someplace. Um, where's the farm store? Uh, there's the shop. Flour mill. Oh, don't tell me the farm store store on the other side of the country. Animal dealer. Adirond Adirondack Sodi? What's that? Farm silo. Oh, there's a little farm down here. Kind of, sort of. Isn't it cute? Central Grain. Seed factory. Furt Lime Liquid Furt up north. You mean in the city? In the city? In the city? In the city. Up in here somewhere? Or up here? It's all north up here. West of the city. Go yet, go west, young man. Don't ask me why I bought such a big fertilizer spreader because I was not wanting to do fertilizer very, very long. West of the city. Now, do I need to get on the freeway? Or, let's see. City streets, there. West of the city, so over here then, somewhere. So I should probably be on the freeway, no? Yes, take the freeway. Right. Freeway driving here. Susquehanna Valley, exit two miles. It's a Susquehanna hat factory. Frivage, whatever that means. Towers. Uh oh, get scared. Man, the speed limit is pretty good. 65. I don't think I can go that fast, can I? 42. Man, 
man, we're trucking now. Burger King. I don't care about the Burger King. They're okay, I guess. McDonald's fries are ten times better. I don't know where to go. Was I supposed to get off the freeway? Exit coming up. Uh, there's a delay. Was that exit the one I just missed? I missed the exit. Well, I was past the exit before I saw your what's it there because of the delay. Burger Chef and Jeff, I don't remember that, but I didn't eat uh, a lot of uh, fast foods. We we had uh, Ma and Pa hamburger diners. We didn't have big brand names. Uh, I mean, we did, but not in the town I lived in. So, uh, I don't remember that kind of thing. All I remember is the Burger King sitting at the end of your bed staring at you while you were sleeping. That was spooky. I don't know. There's no place to turn around. It seems. Where? Where am I? What's 67? I don't know what that is. Uh, uh oh. Uh, what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> How do I end up up here? Um, I wanted to be down on that freeway. Going the other way. Can I do it? Ah, ha, ha. More than one way to skin a cat. See? Things just work out when you do things the rude man way. You gotta love it. I actually got lucky and there wasn't a guardrail there. Because notice there's a guardrail there now. And it probably got tied up on the guardrail. I didn't use the brake. I just went flying over. <laughs> uh, no braking done by me. Look, there's a big pile of grain over there. Why do I have to harvest? Couldn't I just go in there and steal some off that pile? What happened to the good old days when we used to be able to steal the neighbor's grain and nothing happened to you? I ate that zinger. Now I'm now I'm uh, picking coconut out of my tongue. Although I do like coconut, it's sure the coconut sprinkles. Oh God! Addie made some brownies the other day, and she wanted to put sprinkles on them. Why? Because she's only 12 years old. I about broke my damn teeth on those sprinkles. They were so hard. I had to scrape them off the brownies. Well, she made she didn't make the cake brownies. She made the kind that has uh, uh, frosting, you know. Okay, where do I bind the grain? Uh, fertilizer. Uh -huh. 
<laughs> Borrow with intent. I like that. That's good. So, well, anyway, I don't know where the fertilizer is. I guess I'll just drive around now. See what I can find. <laughs> Uh-oh. I'm going to get stuck behind this plant. Not that way. I hate this delay. By the time he says not that way, I'm already there. Oh, man, I'm falling asleep. I can't help it. I can't help it. That's not how the song goes, but it was the next turn. What next turn? Off the freeway? The next turn off the freeway? See, I went that way. Are you talking about this way? This don't look like that. Oh, what's this? This don't look like real fertilizer. This is like liquid stuff. That ain't gonna work. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Um, about here. No, the same did either. Nothing. Nothing. In building is dry fur. Well, why would they have these? pipes out if you have to drive in the building. Oh, that's retarded. That ain't right. Oh, it's another spout. Another pipe. Fertilizer. What else can you get here? Nothing, just fertilizer. Why do they have a choice button if there's nothing in here but fertilizer? I don't know how much to buy, but I don't think I want to fill this thing up, but I'm not sure. Depends on how much it's going to cost me. Good Lord. I spent 150000 already. All right, I'm going to stop it. I don't know how much to buy. So I don't want to spend all my damn money. I won't get that back. Well, it's always hard the first time. Once you find it and know where to go, then the second time will be easy. Know what I mean? Besides, this whole live stream is just waste, wasting my time. Oh, I didn't mean it that way. Wasting my time. I mean, it's using up my time. My time. Entertaining. None of that came out right. And, I, and I'm not recording this, so I can't edit it out. So just forget anything I said in the last minute. Jesus. This stuff must be heavy. I can't steer. How come my camera won't change? Oh, never mind. Why just stick your camera over there? That's weird. I think I need a weight on the front of this thing. I'll have to remember to buy a weight when I get back. Put it on here. This freeway? 
Yeah, I'm kind of sliding around the corners. There's, uh, I need weight on the front of this thing. You see the front's kind of lifting up. I saw a squirrel in the backyard. Carol, Carol said, oh, we got a squirrel in the backyard. And I looked out in the backyard and I said, squirrel? It's like a dog, it's so big. And I said, you know, we're lucky we live in Oregon. If we lived in Arkansas, that would already be somebody's dinner. And nothing about Arkansas. My wife's from Arkansas, well, her family was from Arkansas. She was born in uh, Washington State, but <clears throat> her folks were from Arkansas, and every time I'd go visit, they'd try to get me to eat squirrel meat. They canned it like you would peaches or, or cherries or, you know, any other fruit. They canned their squirrel meat, and her dad was always pulling out a can of squirrel meat trying to get me to have dinner with him. I said, no, thank you. You can eat that all up. All by yourself. Don't need me. I wouldn't even know how to cook it. And I really wouldn't want to eat it. Anybody know where I'm at? When do I have to get off the freeway? <coughs> right here. I think. Is 68 and 67 the same field? Why does it show 67? I don't get it. It's showing 67 green like we like we leased it. Didn't it? I thought it did on the big map. It does. 67 says I've leased it. I don't remember leasing that. The crop is on it. What? What? What crop is that? Uh soybeans and it's ready to harvest holy smokes i didn't know that i got another crop i don't understand why i have another crop where's my combine there it is well too late now anyway i did not know that i don't have a header for it I gotta go back and get a header. But, uh, that'll be cool. I can make a little bit more money. You guys watched me when I leased this field. I only leased one field, didn't I don't watch my own stuff, so I'm not going to go back and watch it, but I'm pretty sure I only hit the lease button once. I mean, what happens if I go to uh, the lease page? It says both of them are leased. I only remember hitting the one button, 68. That's weird. That's, that's, what the hell is that? Oh God, what did I just hit? I don't know what I hit to turn that stuff on. Uh-oh. Anybody know what I did?
I don't know what I did. How did I turn that on? Oh, I hit the tilde button. Never mind. I found it. Tilde key. Yeah. Thanks, uh, thanks, Banks. I, I, I don't use that, so I'm not used to it. I mean, every once in a while I'll use the F5, but I'm not. I don't use any other junk doodle do. Anyway, I'm gonna call it for the day, guys. Uh, by the time I go find a uh, a header, it's gonna be past three anyway. So hopefully I'll be back on Thursday if I feel like it. Um, you know, I did I did mention I didn't go into any details, but I've had a pretty rough couple of weeks. So um, that's uh, that's what's going on between uh, doctors and COVID uh, vaccinations and and a couple of other things. I've not had a very good two two or three weeks, so I haven't really felt like doing anything. I didn't. Uh, uh, you know, I, I almost didn't do today's. So uh, hopefully I'll be back on Thursday. And I hope you join me there. We'll continue this crazy thing here. Uh, appreciate it, guys. I really do. And hope to see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.